Hey guys, uh, it's Greg from The Current War here. I have a couple attacks from our last war to share with you. Uh, unfortunately, it wasn't the best war for us, but we did have a couple attacks worth sharing. Uh, Rudy here is going to try out this HGHB special. I've seen some videos about this online. He's attacking this 8.5 here. Um, but still, pr pretty good base. Uh, a lot of different compartments. Queen's kind of protected there. Um, so, this base was unknown. Uh, we can see his troop comp here. Two heals, two rage. And he has bowlers in the clan castle. So the key with this strategy is you have to path well because you have to make sure that your heroes and bowlers both go straight to the core of the base um, because that's what's doing most of your damage. The giants and healers are just there to tank and the hogs are just clean up. It's all about the heroes and the bowlers. So let's take a look. Uh, he's going to come in here from the southwest side. Uh, he de deploys the healers right away. There's no air defense nearby. This strategy does not use wall breakers, uh, but turns out that 12 or 13 giants break a wall reasonably fast. Look at that. Look at that pathing here. He dropped his wizards from the outside in, so he kills these outer buildings first. And um, that's just going to make sure this goes smooth as silk. So, okay. He broke the wall. Now here come the bowlers and heroes in quick succession. Okay, so the clan castle starts to come out. He's going to use his first rage and a poison to deal with that. Um, so that's the first spell. That also gets the attention towards the middle, and the bowlers and king just kind of kill her queen very quickly. Okay, so now we're to the middle. He drops another rage. So the first rage is for clan castle. The second rage is to help clear out uh, the core and kind of get through that, all those wizard towers and heroes quickly. Okay, so right here we're in good shape. Uh, the healers are kind of move around. Um, that's you know a big part of this strategy, of course. The skeleton traps did nothing to the bowlers. Uh, the healers are kind of free range a little bit. Um, here they switched over to the giants. The air defenses are nowhere near, so that's fine. The bowlers kind of went askew. Now he's deploying his hog surgically, just two or three at a time on those defenses. Uh, a bunch here on this archer tower. You know there could be some giant bombs over here. Not a double wouldn't trigger properly, so he's going to drop a heal here. Uh, that ends up being really good. You know, the heroes are just cleaning up. There aren't many defenses over there. It's just kind of junk buildings, and the giants tank for the couple defenses over, and the heroes kind of clean up no problem. Um, we're going to see, you know, he has a Tesla there, Tesla down there, and a bunch of hogs left, you know, Bowler's out here doing his thing, and, uh, you know, just no problem. He doesn't even need that last heal spell. So sweet three-star by Rudy. Uh, I think this strategy can be very powerful. You know, Rudy has 10-10 heroes, and... This guy had pretty good walls, I guess, for an 8.5, and then some upgraded defenses. So this is uh, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. So nice job, Rudy, and uh, hopefully we'll have some more of these HGHBs to share with you soon. Thanks for watching.